Let's hear from Brittany. Coming all the way from Mississippi to Cerritos, she decided to pursue her passion for helping kids and teaching. Brittany's pursuing a degree in child development and wants to change the lives of children every day. Brittany, take it away. Thanks, Alex. In 2013, I graduated high school and went to another local college. I found myself in a wrong crowd. About a year and a half later, I dropped out. But when it was time for me to return, I discovered Cerritos. When I came here, I knew I wanted to follow my passion and study child development. Growing up, I always been the babysitter, the fun cousin, and I volunteered to work with kids in daycares. Teaching children is something I always wanted to do. Through our child development and teacher track programs, I've been able to attend conferences and learn different teaching methods. Both programs have made it possible for me to gain more professional insight and build relationships with others in my field. I have had great mentors and I'm happy to say I'll soon be transferring to Cal State Fullerton. Being active on campus has also been a good way for me to stay engaged and meet new people. Throughout the year, I participated in Emoja, Phi Theta Kappa, and have used resources from Hovindness, Falcon's Nest, and Teacher Track. All of the programs I've been involved with have offered helpful resources like book vouchers, housing assistance, food, and hygiene items. I've been able to get a free bus pass from the Metro. Even off-campus Cerritos has changed my life. After coming back to college, I would have never thought I would be able to complete my courses and graduate with a 3.4 GPA. I'm a first-generation student and I couldn't have done it without my support system here at Cerritos. Special shout out to my counselor who's been like my mom, Dr. Fisher. Thanks. Well, that's enough for me, folks. Right back at you, Alex. Wow, Brittany, those are great resources for students at Cerritos College. We can see how affordable housing and free transportation, food and hygiene can definitely make the difference for first-gen students like you. Thank you so much, Brittany, for sharing your story. 